again vlogmas day two and i just got back from church so welcome back so let's talk about something don't mind me i have laundry on the couch that is supposed to be folded but i have to do this first before i get to that so i just got back from ch from church and i just discovered something we do say that we love jesus or we love god but how much are we willing to give to him to prove our love for him have you ever asked yourself that because today someone was about being in love being in love with yourself being in love with god being in love with some being in love and when you're in love you do give something that is of value to you what is that valuable thing that you have this month of december as we say that this is the month when jesus was born could be true could be a lie but i like to take this time to reflect on the love of god because we know that he was born of the virgin mary so it was a love that no man could understand no man understands till today and god gave us his only begotten son so it cost him someone something because for god so loved the world so that he gave so when you love someone when you love something you give to it you give to them so in this aspect i feel like in most cases when we are saying that we love someone or we love something there are times that we limit our love in that i can't give this because they don't give but god gave you everything that he did give you even went to the extent of giving his only begotten son to die for you on the cross for our christians because if you are celebrating christmas i would want to believe you're celebrating it because you're a christian not necessarily because that's when god was born but jesus was born sorry but because it reminds you of how much god loves you that's what i think of christmas not because jesus was born on christmas day because i don't believe that but i do believe that god loved us so much he loved me specifically me so much that he died he sent his only begotten son to die for me the cup was too heavy and too much for jesus to bear that he wanted it taken away from him but god let him go through with it for my sake so i want to ask you when you love someone when you love god what is it that you're doing for him what is it that you're doing that makes him feel loved by you because definitely for us we are sure that jesus loves us we are sure that god loves us but how do you show your love for god how do you do it i would want to really know like how do you do it is it just by words what do you give what is that um prized possession that you have that you like this is the my most prized possession and if god was to call me and ask me to give it to him i wouldn't hesitate think about it jesus loves us so much that he went to the extent of dying for us not even sin can come between the love that he has for us but what do we do what how do we reciprocate that because i believe if you don't if someone says they love you and they can't reciprocate how you're showing your love to them or they can't love you how you're asked to be loved you're asking to be loved you won't be comfortable being with that person for long but our god is not like that he loves us regardless so i'm asking you again are you truly in love with god or are you just enjoying saying that you love god think about it happy vlogmas day two see you tomorrow